Hello Taurus, welcome to the channel. I hope you're all doing well. Now we have divine timing here. So this is spirit at work. Things come to fruition when the time's right and not before. In the spirit world, there is no time. Signs and reminders. Now this is spirit trying to connect in with you. They're trying to show you that they are around and they are supporting you. So you might be seeing birds, you might be seeing butterflies, feathers. So be open here to the signs that are going on around. When we're trying to achieve goals in life, we are co-creating with spirit in the universe. Spirit, please show me the guidance in relation to this message. If this starts to resonate, please like, share and subscribe. We have the Eight of Pentacles. The Queen of Wands. The Page of Wands. The Three of Swords. The King of Cups. The Three of Wands. The Lover's Cards, which is Gemini energy, which might be relevant, but this is about choices. The Seven of Wands. There's lots of wands here. And the Judgment Card. Now, this here is about you making decisions and judgment calls. Now, this is choices. There's been heartache and upsets that you've been through here. Now, I do feel this is something you're getting over. Uh, you've made choices here. It couldn't be in relation to, with respect to relationships, but it doesn't have to be. This could be to do with uh, your work, your finances or your environment. But what we've got here is this is a, a, a three of swords and it's a temporary place that you're in at the moment. These clouds will clear and you're making choices here. I do believe that you're on the right path here. I do think that you're inspired. You're making you're going to make right choices for yourself if you haven't already. So yeah, I think you might be getting over this or you're coming out the other end of it. These disappointments. But the overall energy here is about your happiness and being around the right people that can support you at this time. Now, there's a path here that you've chosen and been inspired to go down. You've listened to your intuition. It's about making that judgment call in relation to your past experiences here. And the judgment call that you make or the choices that you're making here is going to release you from all the past disappointments that you've been going through. Now, Spirit is sending you reminders here. They're trying to help you make this judgment call for your future. And you're going to be like a phoenix rising from the ashes. So this is about your new inspired path. It's time now. It's a perfect time to be making this judgment call in relation to the disappointments that you've been going through. And it's about getting on that boat. There's something you're passionate about. If you listen to your intuition, you will be guided down this path. And it's about getting on that boat and getting on with it. Your ships will come in. So don't be frightened to make this judgment call. Um... The fact that you've been inspired to take up this new opportunity or go down this path is not happening by accident. Spirit is guiding you here. The universe is guiding you. And it's about being passionate about what you're investing in. You're putting your heart and soul into something here. And what we've got here is focusing on that. The hard work that you put in will pay off. Focus on your goals. Let the disappointments from the past go. The upsets go. They were designed to make room so that you would connect in with your intuition and make room for this new venture, this new inspired path. And this is coming up all the time in these readings. Focus on what's important to you. Do not waste your energies on incidental things. It's about getting your head down, putting your heart and soul into things that you really enjoy, most definitely. Now, this could be an opportunity for a new relationship, like we've said earlier, a Gemini energy. This could be Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy, or people coming in Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio energy. So, you know, you could be focusing on that if that's what you desire, but it's about anything. This could be new courses, it could be new jobs, it could be promotions, it could be investing money, um, anything that you desire here. It's about your focus and overall it's definitely about your happiness. So focus on what's right for you here. Make the right judgment call. Move away from the disappointments. Spirit will um, connect in with you. They're supporting you here to get onto this path where you're feeling good about things and great about life. And like I say, the right people will show up here. This is people who've got your back. It could be new lovers, new friends, um, new tutors, new support networks, good bosses. Anything here or anyone that's going to be beneficial will start to show up in your life. So this is a major choice. Spirit's reminding you here that this is the perfect time to be making calls to move away from disappointing energies or anything that's upsetting you. And it's about looking to the future and being inspired to create things. And anything that you're inspired to do, you will get onto that path. Your ships will come in with it and you'll start to see 
I beg your pardon, you will start to see progress in whatever it is that you're taking up. Come together. Come together. Fairies like to be busy and a group of them is showing you that many hands make light work. Working as a team helps get the job done. Now, when we're co-creating, we're working with spirit in the universe. So we're, it's about working together with spirit here to get onto that path that will serve you best. Okay, I hope this helps. Please like, share and subscribe and I'll see you again soon. Bye bye.